How are things rolling, viewers? Brad, proprietor of Barstool Entertainment, doing another GTA 4, The Lost and the Damned walkthrough video. As I stated before, I'm not a huge fan of GTA 4, but I do love this expansion pack. And if you have viewed the first video I've done, Clean and Serene, you can see why this game got so much better with this concept. Now, this mission is called Liberty City Choppers. Uh, Johnny is helping the treasurer, Jimmy, steal some bikes so that he can sell them to a dealer who ships them over to Japan for some money. And in this mission, I kind of had the carbine already picked up and should have armed it up better, but you can kind of see in this mission how a carbine rifle is much better than a pistol or a sawed-off shotgun. So let's get on with this mission. What's going on, Jim? Hey, Johnny boy. You know the deal? If it ain't one load of bullshit, it's a goddamn another. Tell me about it. I'm coming close to really losing my shit here. Well, you ain't gonna like what I'm about to do in the next few hours. What? We gotta go steal some bikes from the Angels of Death. Ain't we a little too old for stealing bikes and clubhouse flags and crap like that? <laughs> it don't help nothing. Yeah, I hear you, man, but these bikes are the real deal. Now, I got a guy who pays me for them, and then he ships them over to Japan. Apparently, they're gonna go crazy for these bikes in particular. Now, business is business, and the Angels, they're the Angels. So do it for the memories. Okay, it's been a little while since you and me have been on a prank like this together, hasn't it? <laughs> too right, brother, <laughs> too right. Who knows? Might be fun. <laughs> As stated before in other um, videos, I'm going to fast forward through the ride because I don't want to get knocked for uh, some form of copyright violation. And unless there's some kind of interesting and witty banter between the guys, I really don't see any real need to uh, kind of go through the whole long ride process. So let's get forward to the next major event. Now Johnny and Jimmy must take this big truck to where the Angels of Death are and steal some bikes. And, I mean, they can leave their bike, their own bikes alone because, hey, it's in a protected area. Now, again, go to a diner and steal some bikes. There's some interesting banter here. And I'll let you guys read it and as I'm talking because it's, again, interesting and very funny. There's talk about what Jimmy would do if his old lady and kid had to deal with him not being around. And it shows a softer side. And these guys, obviously, you know, they've got brotherhood going. And again, it's really interesting and kind of, uh, yeah, I lost track of where the road is here. I'm going to kind of back up and get realigned here. But hey, he's sort of a thinking type uh, bad guy. Now that I got the truck reoriented here, uh, it's a short drive to the diner, so I'm going to keep on yapping here. And once you get the truck parked properly, you see the bikes, and it's up to Johnny to load, but a firefight erupts, which is more interesting than loading the bikes. You're better off fighting with Jimmy than trying to load the bikes.
okay, it's fairly obvious, you're on the bike, you ride it up onto the back of the trailer or truck, and then you are going to have to run back and get in a firefight with Jimmy, and I just shot off several rounds from the carbine, which is the, uh, as you can see, it took a guy down pretty quickly. And it would make short work of all these other guys, except, again, uh, yeah, Johnny just throws it away, and uh, now you got to kind of get into the sawed-off shotgun, and good thing you picked up some body armor, right? Well, let's get on with this uh, whole uh, firefight, and then we'll load up some bikes. Now that that is over, time to load up some bikes. I'm going to run Johnny back here, grab this one, and then grab others in succession. You need to get four bikes, and then you need to get the hell out of the area because, uh, yeah, the other gang is a little upset that you just killed a bunch of their members and are stealing their bikes. Uh, if you noticed, there is, during the firefight, a notice pops up that you can call some other guys for backup. To be honest with you, by the time they arrive, you could end up dead. So you're better off with body armor and a carbine rifle and plenty of ammo, and you can firefight your way through most of the missions. Now, I'm talking over the bike loading because I didn't turn off the sound. And I, to be honest with you, don't want to turn off the sound because the soundtrack for this game adds on to Liberty Rock Radio some really awesome songs. And it's so much fun listening to the music and playing it was no big deal for me for GTA San Andreas because some of the music was dated and I wasn't really into it, so I didn't care. But in this case, oh yeah, gotta love the music. So let's get back into the truck and get on with the delivery. Okay, let's get this truck back to your guy. Yeah, you can hear that brief bit of music. Now, again, the opposing gang shows up and they start attacking. Just, you know, keep driving and keep your mind on the road and don't let it get rattled because the truck can take the damage. In fact, you can kind of plow your way through, through if need be and, again, the truck will be able to take the damage. Like right now, you just slam into cars and smash through everything. And again, the opposing gang, they're upset. And they will, to the bitter end, try and take you down. And again, the truck will take the damage. Don't worry about it. Just keep driving and keep the pedal down. And if you have any issues 
you got to turn the truck around like this. Uh, the bad guys are going to come at you. Uh, just run over them. In fact, on my way to... Ah, I'm getting lost here. On my way to the uh, area here, I just got lost. I'm just going to try and get turned around here. And again, the posing... Oh, well, yeah, I did a lot of damage to this truck. But let's see if I can get back on track and get these guys back safely. They're, they even lost a tire. Wow, okay. And, yeah, uh, Jimmy takes these guys down pretty quickly. And I just ran over. In fact, backing up here and run this guy right over. And the other guy is dead. You got to get into this warehouse area to drop off the bikes. That's where I missed things. I got a little off track here. And again, I'm going to keep talking because I don't want to get knocked off here until we get to the end. We should unload a couple of these bikes. A prospect can handle the truck. Alrighty then, amigo. Oh, I always get a kick out of sticking it to them pants. Old habits die hard, brother. Yep. Too bad times weren't always this easy. Oh, shit. Be cool, man. Well, what do we have here? Looks to me like a couple of mopes with some stolen bikes. These bikes are ours, officer. Nobody's gonna be reporting these bikes stolen, so give us a break. Oh, looks like these mopes have outsmarted us, don't it? Unbelievable. These inbred biker rednecks get smarter every year. <laughs> Your parents must have been fucking brilliant siblings. Yeah, funny. Think you're smart? How smart are you gonna feel when we drag your old lady downtown, turn the cameras off, and interrogate her real hard? Man, I bet she'll love it. Yeah. She'll be begging us for another fucking interrogation in no fucking time! Oh! oh we were watching the Angels of Death shit, birds! That's right, we saw the whole thing, you fucking jerk-offs. Case closed. And now you're gonna fucking pay us, just like your daddy paid your mama for sex. Skank bitch wouldn't even give her own brother a freebie. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. yeah, think of a number, assholes. And it better be a big one. While you're at it, we're gonna be watching. So you better behave yourselves, boys. Ha! Watch it, this. Look. Excellent. Fucking cocksuckers. <laughs> Fucking pricks like those who have maybe joined the lost in the first place. I'm gonna go back to the clubhouse. See who's around. Later, man. Later. Great. You get shook down by some crooked cops. That will be dealt with in the near future. Um, if you like this type of video, don't forget to subscribe. I will be putting more GTA Lost and Damned videos up in the future. And if you just like this video, hit the like button. But please don't forget to subscribe. I don't know how things are um, at this point in time because, again, I put these videos out uh, way ahead of time. I might have the 100 subscribers, I might not. But that is my goal, to get 100 subscribers. And those of you who are subscribing, thank you. I appreciate it. And I'll continue to put out more videos. Well, this is Brad, proprietor of Barstool Entertainment. As always, thanks for stopping by.